Mike Chrysler here with Hero Dad Bods. Today we're gonna to be making some high protein, low carbohydrate superhero pancakes. First things first, you're gonna want some of your favorite protein powder. I use this here from Hidden Tech. I get over at Designer Body. It is a good, high quality grass fed protein isolate. You can use any kind you want. I really recommend using something with a protein isolate. Second up, I'm gonna go along with some almond flour. Kinda goes along the keto lifestyle, but also a really good low carb, really low glycemic index, so it's gonna really help your blood sugar stay low, so you can really enjoy these pancakes. Found a really nice sugar-free syrup here. This one's made by Maple Groves. Just go to your local grocery store, find a sugar-free syrup, then a little bit of coconut oil. I'm gonna put one teaspoon in there. Just a really great fat source. The flavor's good, especially mixed with some of these protein powders. Good old fashioned baking powder. A Couple of room temperature, nice eggs. And you guys all know this, one of my favorite ingredients, good old fashioned sea salt. And last but not least, do yourself a favor, go find some sugar-free, heavy whipping cream. Zero carbohydrates, 20 calories, and it's whipped cream. So who doesn't like whipped cream, all right? Have some fun. Next up, quarter cup of milk. I use whole milk. And one thing I forgot to tell you guys, we're gonna actually make these blueberry pancakes. So I'm gonna add, add it in one cup of gluten-free almond flour. Do in a half of a teaspoon of baking powder. Last, but I think the most important ingredient is my good old grass-fed whey protein isolate. I'm going to add in two scoops of this protein, which is about 60 grams of protein. And then we have 12 grams of protein in the eggs and another five grams of protein in the milk. This whisk is uh, not working, so I usually use a fork. I was trying to be cool for you guys since this is a cooking show, but I'm gonna go back to the old fashioned fork. There we go, we're just gonna mix that up nice. Fork works good. It's a little bit chunky, chunkier than a normal pancake, but not much. And the chocolate flavor is just gonna be dynamite especially when you throw the blueberries in there. So I forgot, as we add the protein powder into this recipe, we do need a little more liquid. So I'm gonna go with another half a cup of whole milk, which again is gonna give us another four more grams of protein. This is kind of the consistency that you're gonna to wanna to have this look like right here. Just nice, kind of drips off just like a normal pancake. All right, I'm gonna heat up my pan with some, and I'm gonna put some butter in there, get that kind of nice and ready to go so we can pour it on and it'll start, uh, start cooking. Next up, I'm gonna have my blueberries here. You know, they don't measure them out. I got a nice handful of blueberries there. Last little ingredient to add is my favorite, as you guys know, good old sea salt. Just get a good dash in there. All right, gonna get the pan nice and buttered up. Oh yeah, that's gonna be good. Some people don't respond well to high fat diets. I happen to be one that does. And all the people I've been working with, they seem to be getting the same response. There's lots of data on it. It's not keto, and I'm, I'm not against keto. Uh, but low carb lifestyle does require a little more fat. And who doesn't like butter? All right, here it goes. Let's see what we can make here. Believe it or not, that's about a 30 gram pancake right there, 30 grams of protein. Now we wait and we just look and we dream about eating pancakes. You wanna be looking down at these things. You're looking at for the little bubbles that kinda of come up in here. Once you get enough bubbles, turn them over. I cook these on about a medium high heat. Right, these are looking pretty good, ready to flip. Here we go, the moment of truth. Boom, oh, look at that. Nice and golden crisp from the butter right there. Not burnt, just done just right. Mm, more, see if I can pull this off. You guys can do this. Oh, broke one, that's okay. Might have to cook them just a little bit longer than you would a normal pancake, just because that protein powder is it's kind of holding things together a little bit more than normal, so it takes a little bit longer for that to break down. But worth it. Might flip these dishes one more time, which is not normal in the normal pancake world. I get it. The protein pancakes are a little more special. You gotta put a little more love in them. They are going to be amazing. All right, I'm gonna plate these up and we're gonna dish them up with some butter, some syrup, and some whipped cream. So this plate, my plate's gonna have 60 grams of protein. <laughs> we're gonna throw on our sugar-free syrup. Again, 10 calories per serving. We're gonna go a little more than two servings. Last thing, Heavy cream, so I'm going heavy cream because it's just the fat content and it's right, that ratio, which is, it really, really makes for a nice, healthy way to go. There we go. Dip that in my syrup a little bit. Ooh, look at the blueberries coming through. You got everything in there, guys. Mm. 
Oh, fuck yes. Oh my God, that is, mm, mm, that's perfect. Just start trying some of this stuff. Have fun with it. You know, your body will thank you for it. Your spirit will thank you for it. You feel good about yourself. You know, adopt this lifestyle. It is not hard. Once you get going, the positive feedback loop of doing this healthy stuff, it, it really, it really will pay off. A couple years ago, I was diagnosed with pre-diabetes, believe it or not. I was working out, I was trying to eat right, but I was eating a kind of a more higher carbohydrate, you know, pretty decent amount of protein, low fat diet. I've switched that around. I have no, none of those health markers now as far as pre-diabetes goes, that's completely gone. My body's way leaner. I have way more energy. You know, as we get older, those, those diagnoses are not, they're not anything to joke around with. So on a serious note, these type of, these type of, 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 of uh, eating plans are so good for you and for things like diabetes, pre-diabetes, heart conditions, you know. So it tastes good. You're going to get a lean six pack, but also you're going to help yourself stay out of the healthcare system. So, you know, do that for yourself, all right, just from the bottom of my heart. All right. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, it was really fun, really delicious. Uh, if you like this recipe, um, please comment. Let me know what you thought of it. You know, I'd like to hear, hear some feedback and if, if it's helped them change your life a little bit. Also, if there's any other recipes you'd like to me to try out that you have ideas for, comment on those as well. But also, please, please like this video, subscribe it. Um, I'm here for you. Be healthy, be happy, be fit. Get it.